What is good, everybody? What is good? Sports Live in the ATL. Sports Live in the ATL Fitness and Sports Channel. Like, comment, subscribe. I'm about 50-something subscribers away from 4K, folks. So all you newbies out there who have subscribed to my channel, share it out. It's just going to keep getting better and better. Okay, give an update, everybody, on the, the Bill Belichick situation with the Falcons. Obviously, we know he had his second interview. He was wine, dined. He got proposed to be married. Uh, so he and Arthur Blank probably will I will announce the uh, honeymoon at some point. Uh, I, I expect to be there. I'm not going to be filming in a room, but yeah, I, I, I would expect that to happen, God willing. But like I said, all, all accounts point to Bill Belichick. Now, I know the holdup is this stupid Rooney rule. I think it's utterly ridiculous, you know, but it's something that we have to do. That's why we're interviewing all these other candidates which is beyond me because we already know, you know, who wants to be where, you know, it's going to be, it's, it's, it's basically Bill Belichick's job. If he wants it, he's going to get it. Arthur Blake has already made that clear. So I expect something to happen this week. Hopefully. Now, if I'm Arthur Blank, I'm giving Bill Belichick anything he asks for. I don't care if Bill Belichick says, says, hey, let me take over complete control of the team. Cool. Done, sir. Uh, Mr. Blank, uh, can I be the new owner of the team? Sure. I'll sign it over to you. Sure. Just, just, just give me like 5% ownership. Uh, can I take control of uh, concessions? Yep. Can I take control of Marta? Yep. Can I have unlimited uh, supply of Chick-fil-A every day for the rest of my life that I'm here? Yep. Uh, can I get a uh, unlimited pass of Six Flags in Magic City? Yep. Can I, most importantly, Arthur Blank, I need to make sure that I go on Sports Live and the ATL's Fitness and Sports channel for, for uh interview every week. Can that happen? Oh, absolutely. Greatness knows greatness. Give Bill Belichick anything he asks for. Why? Because with Bill Belichick, we have the best chance to win one of these. I know, Falcon fans, you have no fucking idea what this is, but this is a world championship ring. Yeah, it's the Braves version, but yeah, this is what Bill Belichick has six of. Six. He's been to ten as a head coach, one six, and I think he's been to two as a, an assistant and one two. Okay? Falcons are interviewing Raheem Morris. Yeah, right. Uh... Joe, whatever. I know we're doing some defensive coordinator interviews too and OCs and all that, but I mean, come on, man. When you're whining and dining the marriage proposal to Bill Belichick and wanting to have his kids and all this stuff, and then uh, members of his coaching staff are calling the Falcons, asking about our personnel, make it happen. That's why this Rooney rule is so dumb. Now, Jim Harbaugh is going to interview for the second time this week. Again, that wouldn't be a bad choice, but it's not the choice that I want. It's not the choice that the Falcons should want. Okay, again, Bill Belichick is a very good head coach. He has won everywhere he's gone. But he hasn't won a Super Bowl, and he had one shot already and lost in the Super Bowl. In 2012, I believe, right? So why would I want someone who can't win a big game? We've, we've already had that. Dan Quinn, Dan Reeves, Mike Smith, Arthur Smith, couldn't, couldn't even get over 500, Jim Mora. So why would you not want the greatest NFL football coach in NFL history? The guy who has more bling than any rapper here in Atlanta, GA. Bill Belichick can have grills and all this under on his hand and headbands and chains. The man is dripping gold. So why wouldn't you want that atmosphere here? Bill Belichick signing here would bring so many, so many better players, and we already got good players. The players would upgrade even more. The coaching staff would upgrade even more. And there would be hip-hop concerts at the Benz probably every home game, if not more, maybe before and after. It would be a crazy circus here. If the Falcons got Bill Belichick. And all accounts points to Belichick. So, blank, I don't know what you got to do. Just go pick out two uh, coaches uh, to a piece of the Rooney Rule. Fly them in. Give them a coupon from Home Depot. Or give them a gift card for 500 bucks. Interview them for about 10 minutes and tell them to get the hell out. And then bring the second one in. Do the same thing. Tell them to 10 minutes, 15 minute interview. Make, make it look legit. Tell them to get the hell out. And then say, hey, Bill, okay, we're ready now. 
uh, we want you as our head coach. We passed the Rooney Road. Okay, I'm hired, and then we'll get that press conference. That's what I want. That This weight is, like, killing me. It's killing me, man. I'm telling you it is. Because I want it. I want it bad. But I'm not going to come on here and guarantee it. I did a video last week that said the Atlanta Falcons' new head coach will be Bill Belichick. I didn't say it with, 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 with actual fact, actual realist, realistic possibility. If you watch the video, you know, it's more and more like a, a, a video view. But, you know, that's when the rumors started. But I'm not going to come on here and say that uh, Bill Belichick is going to guarantee sign to us like some of these numb nuts are saying. Josina, whatever the hell her name is, people on the radio and whatever. Yeah, he's a done deal. It is not a done deal. It is not a done deal until he signs it and we see the breaking news. It's not a done deal. But it better be a done deal. Arthur Blank, give him the key to the city if you have to. Give him an, and give him an unlimited yearly pass to Quick Trip, to the Varsity, to Chick-fil-A, to the MARTA, to the Coca-Cola Bottling Company. Give him, give him the season tickets to every sporting event here in Atlanta. Make sure you tell him about Sports Live and ATL's YouTube channel also. Give the GOAT whatever he wants. And yes, I know. I know where you hide and mentioned it. And I'm no hypocrite. I detested Tom Brady. I do not like him. I was always, you know, saying that Bill Belichick won because of Brady. I said it out of anger and jealousy and hate. Not hate, but jealousy and envy, right? I want to do it. I want to do what Tampa Bay did a couple years ago, buy a ring. Somebody said, I don't want the Falcons to buy a ring because it won't mean as much. The hell it won't. If we spend millions of dollars and get a Super Bowl championship ring, I'll be dancing in the streets. Yeah, I'll be do partying like it's 1999, and I'll be wearing this and getting my Super Bowl championship merch. And it won't be taken off the mannequins and sent to a foreign country. Yeah. Buy a ring. Oh, yes. Buy it. Money, money. Here comes the money. Here comes the money. Money, 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 money. Buy it. Buy it. Arthur Blank, let's get this done this week, please, before I have an aneurysm or heart attack. Oh, yeah. Thank you, Detroit Lions. And go, Detroit Lions. And I'll see you in the next one. Woo.